want to cross over to Baringo County, understand we'll be talking to the county commissioner there. Uh, we're talking to Amos Ole, um, Parker, who's a human rights activist in the area, and he was telling us of fresh attacks in the area, uh, Makutani a village in particular that has been attacked by raiders of course uh, cattle rustling a huge issue and uh, has also led to loss of life as well and we understand this morning uh, and overnight uh, houses had been set ablaze and police were yet to respond uh, we have the county commissioner now good morning good morning thank you very much for talking to us would you kindly bring us up to speed with what exactly is happening you're not very clear eh? All right, you're live on KTN. If you could kindly just talk to us about what is happening in Baringo County, Makutani uh, village in particular. Uh, we, we, we had an incident last night where uh, uh, some three houses were allegedly burned by uh, a cattle raider. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have security, enough security in that, uh, in that, in that division called Mutani. We have the police, we have the in that, in that, in that, in that place. Um, this area has been uh, having problems because it's uh, occupied by both the Bokota and the community. Um, there has been a problem which may have been uh, attributed to the disputed boundary within the East Pocos and the Barigan uh, or Barigan district. So during that incident, we thought a chief lost a shop mm -hmm. and three other hard houses were burned down, but there were no casualties. All right. Uh, our police, have they responded? Because when we spoke to uh, an activist from the area, he said they tried to they'd call for help, but none had arrived. No, that, not that they, people are already there. Our security post officers were there. Okay. Yeah, they are there. They responded. And you see, this is a, these are houses which are scattered in the, in the, in the, in the village. So the, the security, we have enough security but them there. Uh, what about the raiders? Have any been arrested? No, uh, nobody has been arrested so far. But do we suspect there are people who are behind, inside these communities? And I can assure you that we are going to arrest these people by today. Uh, this is an issue that has been going on in the county. What exactly is the problem? What are the challenges you're facing in dealing with it and bringing it to an end? Excuse me. Uh, the question is, this is a situation you've been grappling with for a while now, the insecurity in as far as, or rather the cattle rustling and uh, pitting the communities against each other. What are you as the county commissioner putting in place to ensure this comes to an end? We have been experiencing the issue, the, 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 this incident since 2004, 8 and 4, 2005. Right? So why because is it... One community, mm. you know that one community is a pastoralist community. Others are, uh, are pastoralists. And we've been having this problem, at, but if you look at Baringo North, the whole of North, the uh, part of South, peace has actually uh, prevailed in that area. Apart from that small area between Mokbani and Arabal, in Arabal, we have added, added more security personnel and force. We have grading Mukutani, we have Shapkalasha camp, we have GCU camps, about three GCU are at sort of camp. And we've just increased the security personnel in Mukutani uh, center. Mm -hmm. Yes. In your so there's no cause for alarm, we are going to end this problem. It is not cause for alarm, sir, you say, but it's, as you said earlier, for many years has been going on, on and off. So what is it that can, you know, bring a conclusive end to it we've so that we don't made, talk about the same already, in the next sorry. few months? We've already made a number of proposals, mm -hmm. like upgrading Mokutani into a full police force. Uh, we've made a recommendation to open more posts so that we can de deepen policing in that area. Okay. We are also making proposals to ensure that the infrastructure, because that place is very, has no infrastructure. Network is a problem. There are no roads. All right?
side. We want to work on that. We've already recommended so that we can open more and more of those areas. All right, sir. Thank you very much for talking to us.